Hi Virgo, I hope you guys are doing awesome. If you're new to my channel, hello, my name is Sean. So we're gonna look at your next 72, and please keep in mind that this reading is general, not personal, so not everything I say may resonate when it comes to your situation. So let's go ahead and look into it, Virgo. We're gonna open up with John 4, 12. It says, no one has ever seen God, but if we love one another, God lives in us and his love is made complete in us. I love that. All right. Let's see what is going on with my beautiful Virgos. I'm a Virgo son, by the way. Hey, hey. Let's see. What's going on for Virgo? What's going on for Virgo? Let's see, what's What is going on for Virgo? I don't really use these cards too often. I decided to use these today. Ooh, impasse here. So we have a block here. Impasse. And environment. Let's see what's going on around them. Ooh, renewal. Okay, so I'm kind of getting a vibe here, Virgo, of some type of blessing in disguise with the impasse here. Interesting. I'm going to pull some more cards to see what this is talking about, but there's definitely some type of blessing in disguise. You are not going to be access. I said not access. You're not going to be able to access something um, for your own protection, whatever this is. I like it, though. Let's see, we have the Ten of Swords here, the past, let's see, Virgo's present, we have the Four of Cups here, what Virgo's not seeing, we have the Eight of Coins, the Vice from Tarot, mm. Hierophant. The Hierophant. Okay, clarification on the Ten of Swords here. Mm -hmm. And clarification on the Four of Cups. Mm. Spirit is saying Cat Daddy. Some of you have like a... <laughs> that's an old saying, Cat Daddy. Um, some of you have a, a love interest that's coming in and trying to offer you something. A male, a King of Cups. All right. All right, let me look at your cards for a second. Okay, Virgo, as I look at your cards, <laughs> this is kind of funny. Okay, so Spirit is playing that song, um, what is that, no, 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 when it's really yes, 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 yes. What song is that? I, don't, I forget who sings that song, it's an old song. Okay, so. Ugh, Virgo, you have somebody that you are actually blocking with this impasse. You are blocking them, but they are coming back. They are coming for you hard. This person in the past right here, we have the Ten of Swords and the Six of Swords in reverse. Um, they may have hurt you in the past with this Ten of Swords energy, and you are not dealing with them. But for some reason, Virgo, in the next 72, they are coming back. Because with the Four of Cups and the King of Wands, this is someone coming back trying to offer you something. But they've already done you wrong. Like, you already know how this is going to play out here. It's like they want a renewal. They want they want a second chance with you. I don't know uh, what you're doing, Virgo, but I feel like they watch you. And they see... <laughs> They see that for some of you Virgos, like you're you're a star in some right or something like that. They see it and they want a part of that. They part they want a part of that. Like they feel regret of what they did and they're coming back. Um, some of you Virgos will definitely get some type of message of somebody being in their feelings or something like that. But you are definitely block blocking them. Um, Spirit is basically telling you what you're doing right here. The Eight of Coins. You working on, just basically focusing on what you're working on is going to give you a relief from con from conflict with the Five of Spears in reverse right here. Like that conflict, the struggle that you were going through 
it's about to be over because you're putting in work right here. Don't let this person throw you off. I also feel like this person is definitely a wolf in uh, sheep's clothing. Um, for your advice here, Spirit is saying with the Hierophant and the Two of Swords right here, this is telling me the way this man is looking like you already know. You already know what it is, Virgo. You already know how this is going to play out with the Two of Swords. You already know how this person is. This person did not change. This person is not a new, did not renew themselves or anything like that. Um, it didn't. It didn't. Like, it didn't. They didn't. They're just putting on the front because they want to get back in there with you. Um, yeah, it's a no. It's a no for me, Virgo. I don't know about you, but I'm pretty sure it's a no for you too. I also still feel like when I initially pulled your cards though, you guys are going to be feeling quite renewed here. Um, I feel like you guys are not letting anybody in your space in the next 72 that's going to cause chaos. Like you're blocking them. I felt like when I first pulled it out that... Actually, no, I still feel that way. There's going to be something in the next 72 that there might be some type of block, like a redirection too. Um, but don't freak out. Keep going. It's, it's basically for your own protection. I still feel like that is going to be happening for you, Virgos. Whatever this is. This can also be like a roadblock, literally, because there's a man standing in the road. Some of you might experience a crazy man in the road. I, I know that sounds weird, um, but no, you, you might have to like just change direction here but overall yeah you already know Ooh. okay now they're playing shaggy it wasn't me like the person <laughs> what is going on with this person the person saying it wasn't them like they're gonna come back and they're gonna say it wasn't them they didn't do that yes they did yes the hell they did they did it and they know they did it they're trying to say whatever you're thinking virgo that they did they didn't do it they did it they did do it they ugh. So irritating. They definitely did the shit. You already know how it plays out. Don't give them any time of day. Keep focusing on what you're doing. Keep focusing on what you're doing because that's going to, the struggle that you've had, Virgo, in the past, it's about to end. And they're just coming in to just fuck that all up like they really are. All right. What's going on else is going on for Virgo? Yeah, there is a need for you in the next 72 to get some sleep. I know I need to get some sleep. I have not been sleeping very well. Some of you Virgos may have had some sleeping problems, but yeah, definitely slow down in the next 72. <laughs> Spirit, it wasn't me. Yes, it was you. Yes, it was you, okay? Like, no, Virgo, I didn't, I didn't do that. I didn't do that. I didn't hurt you like that. You're making that up. Gaslighting. Okay, we have dietary change. So some of you are going to be changing your diet or there's a need for you to change your diet in the next 72. Um, let's see, self-care. Yeah, meditate. Spirit says make sure that you guys are meditating in the next 72. It's going to give you clarity about a situation or what, or give you answers to what you need by simple meditation. I'm going to pull one of these real quick else is happening for Virgo yeah what's going on with Virgo family sorrow dealings with your family here some of you this person is not a lo past love interest this is someone um, that there wasn't any like um, like re love relationship with but they're coming back denying that it was them that did something um and it's someone in your family for some of you virgos i'm just getting that with the trees right here um but some of you are experiencing some type of family tr sorrow and i think that it had something to do with for some of you virgos it was some something that was with your family or maybe you, you um for some of you this person was someone that you had a kid with or something like that was part of your family And we have stepping into a new experience. I love that. Some of you are definitely stepping into a new experience. I see, Virgo, that you guys have a lot of deep personal strength and peace that's going to assure you with a lot of assure you a lot of success. I'm getting right here with the valley right here. Um, but there's going to be some type of dealings with your family in the next 72 that's going to be important too. 
something going on in your family, some type of family change or something like that. <laughs> yeah. Some of you have someone that wants to give their your love a chance. Like somebody's coming back. It's so irritating. Some of you are going to receive some pink flowers or some type of flowers from this person right here. They want you to give their love a chance right here. But you guys have like too, too much difference. And there's like going to be some back and forth. Like you guys, you might be going back and forth. And having some heart to heart conversations. Like I said, it's up to you um, to clear this issue or whatever. But you guys are going to have some type of heart to heart conversations. Um, I'm just telling you. For some of you, this person's a, a wolf in sheep's clothing. That is just my opinion, but oh my, I'm just the reader. I'm just the reader. It is up to you, Virgo. It is your life. Okay. A financial message. Ooh, some of you are getting some type of recognition in the next 72. Some type of recognition for what you do. I'm also seeing, I didn't even notice that was money. Some of you are receiving some type of money. I pull this card a lot and I never even noticed that that was stacks of money, so... Think about some stacks of money. It says you can earn a leadership position or get the recognition you deserve. Your money is looking good and solid. So your money is looking very good, Virgo, and we like that. It says whatever you are working on now will win you the respect from others. So keep doing what you're doing. And a channel message and we'll stop. I'm not going to get so many of these. Mm -hmm. Okay. So it says you are smart enough. So some of you Virgos, if you thought you weren't smart enough, excuse my nails. I know I need to get them done. Um, you are. Yeah. Forgive, but never trust again. I'm telling you this person forgive, but never trust again. I feel like you're going to be telling them how, um, they hurt you and how you really feel like go ahead and do that express how you felt like don't let that go let it go let them know and then just let it go it says you are being tested in the next 72 you will be your patience will be tested you're going to be tested They also want you to not let jealous people bother you in the next 72. People making stupid comments or saying like, I have to deal with that. I've always had to deal with that. Um, ignore them. They're just jealous because they can't do it like you can, Virgo. They can't. They, they can't do it like you can. And then we have housekeeper story. Okay, so they want me to tell you the housekeeper story. So basically, what Spirit wants you to know is if you had to take a step down by any chance, like you guys may have had to take a step down from a position, um, know that there's something in that position that you need to learn. Like, think positively. I had to, when I first moved to this other state of Maryland, when I moved to this state, I couldn't find a job uh, as a nurse because I am a nurse by trade. I couldn't find it because a lot of them were 12 hours and I had small children and I didn't have family to help. So I ended up having to take a job as a housekeeper and I was really annoyed by that. I was very mad because I was like, I, I worked so hard to become a nurse and now I'm doing housekeeping, but I did it. And did you know, I ended up, it ended up changing my um, perspective on housekeeping in general um housekeepers i gain a lot of respect for them that stuff is hard i've learned new ways to clean my home even though i'm still not practicing that and i'm a virgo <laughs> you know i learned really cool ways to get things clean um and i can make one hell of a tissue uh tissue roll flower i can so you know i made the Long story short is I made the best of the situation and I wasn't even there long. After I started appreciating it and I got to see like these, um, I cleaned really nice looking homes too. I got to see these homes and I started to imagine, you know, oh, I want that and I want that. I started getting ideas for my homes um, and how I wanted things done. So, you know, look at the positive of the situation, be grateful and then it will change. And after you get that gratitude going um, and you're seeing it very differently, 
instead of being like, damn, you know, now I have to work as a housekeeper. You know, my life is going to shit. Don't don't look at it like that because you're going to be there even longer. Look at it as a way of, hey, there's some money here. You know, I'm making a little bit of money here. Um, I'm learning this new cool skill skill that I haven't been able to do before. Like, I didn't know that they did it like this. You know, just look at it different and things will change for you. Okay. I had to tell that story to somebody out here because obviously spirit wants me to share it. All right, Virgo. I love you guys so much. Thank you for your support and have a wonderful next 72. Bye.